Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome to an unconventional episode of Lockdown. It is the night of day 35. We're here at the Shotgun Messiah HQ in Joelstown and we're going to try and sneak our way through this building. I've got my night vision goggles on as you can see. That should help us be a little more sneaky, right? I also have on me 150 steel bolts. 50 flaming bolts and 10 exploding bolts in case shit hits the fan and I've got some oh shit candy so we can eat that when we get to the top of the building and just jump off. So let's get started here. Should be interesting. I wanted to do something different for this episode. Oh, I also removed the helmet light mod from my helmet because with that on it makes the night vision look like shit and it also um, wakes zombies up so we don't want that. Um, I also have a skill point to spend. Let's uh, put that into Hidden Strike. This is going to increase our sneak attack damage by 50%. So that should help as well. Granted, we can be sneaky. Here we go. The first room. We're waking him up already. What the fuck? That guy looks radiated. Hard to tell with night vision on, but I'm pretty sure he is. Oh. Hey, Big Mama. Let's close this door. Well, this ain't starting off the way I envisioned it. Dead. Bink. I think I'm going to end up using my club more than the crossbow in this run through. Where's that other zombie outside? Yep. Oh, hey, jump man. Dead. All right, let's get back to it. And try and be sneaky again. Not gonna give up on the sneak just because I blew it on the first room. Um, nothing in there I want. Actually, fuck. I didn't bring any lockpicks. I'm gonna buy this jailbreaker candy then. Hopefully, we can find a lockpick on our way up because there is a hardened chest on the roof. And if I can lockpick it, that would be great. I can't craft one unless I have a workbench, so. Uh, I was going to skip the majority of loot. Only going to loot, like, the important stuff. But we'll see. Maybe I'll kind of loot more than I envisioned, just because I want to try and find uh, lock picks now. Plastic, no, I'm good on that. Hey, there's a bear outside. Attacking a zombie, that's fun. It's a fun world we live in. There's going to be a lot of zombies in this room. We got another one outside. Not concerned about that zombie. Let's see what we can do about being sneaky here. Shit. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh, that's not loaded. Motherfucker. Hey, thanks for that. Ammo. That I can't use. Not now, anyway. Eventually, I will. That's the zombie outside, still. Um, let's try the flaming arrows. Mess around with these for a little bit. Oh! That didn't really slow him down at all. I mean, arrows aren't the best at this stage of the game. No matter what kind of arrows you're using, unless you get sneak damage in, which I'm trying to do, I'm just not doing it very well so far. I'm skipping all the concrete and cobblestone, that's not what this is about. Shit. Guess I can't shoot under tables. Fuck you, burn you bastard. Oh my god, this is turning into a melee-only run, isn't it? So far, not one zombie was I able to take out by being sneaky. Let's go uh, exploding arrows, fuck it. If we're gonna be loud and obnoxious, we might as well be the loudest and most obnoxious. Wake up, bitch! Shit. I'm not expecting this. Yes. How was that? It was fun for me. Um, I think if we break through here, there's a crate. Oh, back up, lady. 
Uh, yeah, up here. There should be one, right? Oh, three of them. Look at that. Nine millimeter. Seven, six, two. And some knuckles we can sell. And we woke up some zombies going for these crates, but what does it matter? We're fucking waking them up the moment we walk in a room anyway. Might as well get some shotgun messiah crates. I'm gonna switch back to the bolts, though. Let's save those exploding bolts for maybe the rooftop. What the hell? I am the opposite of sneak. Yeah, bitch. I hit hard as fuck, though. That's how I make up for it. Zombies up in there. Hey, big mama. I don't know why I'm kneeling down like that. I'm not gonna get any sneak damage in when they're running right at you. Whoops. You know, the night vision is really not necessary in this area. There we go. Three lockpicks. Beautiful. Now, uh... I'll just save at least one of them. And that uh, jailbreaker candy for the rooftop. And we won't have to beat into that uh, hardened chest. Hollow point ammo for the magnum. Uh, let's eat this food. Alright, back into sneak mode. I'm not giving up on the sneak. Just because I failed at every single attempt to be sneaky so far, doesn't mean I'm going to give up. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep trying. We got a gun safe right here. I believe this is the shooting range. And there's nothing in here. Nothing worth looting anyway. Uh, I don't think so. I'm good there. Let's get into this safe. You know what? We got three lockpicks. Let's try to pick this safe. If I break two lockpicks, though, then we'll just beat into it. Because, like I said, uh, we got to save at least one lockpick for the rooftop. All right, there we go. Didn't break any. Nice. Let's keep it moving here. You know what, though? I'm going to scrap both of these pickaxes for the steel tool parts, since we already have steel tool parts in our inventory. All right, let's go. Back to being sneaky. I know there's a couple of bathrooms up ahead, and they are filled with zombies. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, look at that! Our first sneaky kill. Now, let's, uh, maybe we can close this door. Oh, shit! Back to the club, I guess. Good old trusty club. Look at them, just piling out of the bathroom. What were all you motherfuckers doing in there? Oh, shit! They're coming out of the second bathroom. Uh, yes. Fuck you. Well, we're holding our own, at least. Now oh, we leveled up again. We should probably spend that skill point. There's another sneaky perk. From the shadows. Hide in the shadows 13% more effectively. Our sound is more muffled, and we can move faster when sneaking. Probably should have really worked on buffing those, um perks up before attempting this run, but why would I do that? That would just make it easier. I don't know where all these zombies are at. Some are upstairs, maybe? I think there are some behind this door here. I want to get back out to the jeep and unload before we proceed any further. Oh, look at this. This makes things easy. The bear. Forgot about the bear. It's attacking another zombie. Maybe he's my ally. Just don't know it yet. Probably not, though. So you know what? I think I'll kill him. It's hard to tell with the uh, with these uh, night vision goggles on, but I'm pretty sure it's a standard bear, which we can get some good meat from. So let's try exploding arrows. <laughs> That's fun. Yeah, get stuck on that car. Is it stuck? Oh, it's not stuck. Let's get behind this door. Did I kill it? Nope. 
Oh, now I did. And that's how you hunt bears. Get yourself uh, half a stick of dynamite, strap it to an arrow, light it, and boom. Literally boom. You get yourself a bear. All right, this is where we left off with these bathrooms here. There might be a zombie around the corner. No? Must have woke all of them up. Let's check the registers here. A little bit of coin. We are thirsty and hungry. Oh, coffee. Perfect. Some food would be nice. Not really sweating it, though. We're not that hungry. Oh, shit. Damn it! Man, I could have nailed that. I wasn't expecting zombies up at the top of the ramp there. I don't remember there being zombies up there. I guess I shouldn't just go by my memory, right? I should be taking this a little bit more slow. I mean, that's the whole point of this episode, was to do, like, a... a sneaky kill episode where I'm, like, real stealthy and shit. So far, we've killed one zombie by being stealthy. Holy shit! You crazy fucking bird. <laughs> just broke right through the glass. All right, back to being stealth. We gotta get more stealth kills, seriously. It is satisfying. Oh, here we go. Dead. That's beautiful. Dead. Look at that, see? Told you, it's fucking so satisfying. Yes. Oh, I am stealth. Here we go. Unstoppable. There might be zombies, um, in here. Yeah. Oh, shit. That wasn't the best tactic. Oh, nice. We got an action star over here. I was looking for that bird. We woke up another bird. I heard it. Yeah, see? It's out here somewhere. There it is. Oh, shit, we missed that? Fucking bird. Gotcha that time. Shit. Knew I shouldn't have looted that trash. I just woke up at least one of the businessmen in here. Yeah, there he is. I guess looting makes noise. I think that makes sense. Uh, waking up more. Fucking A, man. I am not good at this. Come on out here. Bang. Bam. I'm good at this, though. Oh, shit. There's a bird out here. Oh, I'm stuck on... Oh, this guy's still alive. All right. At least we're safe from the bird. Oh, shit. Was the bird in here the whole time? I don't know, I got like tunnel vision with these night vision goggles on. I'm good on that paintbrush. I'll check this box. Gotta check boxes. Desert Vulture, schematic we already know, and some duct tape. Alright, back to being sneaky. Okay. Fuck you, I mean, he was radiated. I figured we weren't gonna drop him with one shot. Nothing in there. All right, let's get back to it. Sneak mode enabled. I know we got a bunch of zombies in here. Oh, I see a foot. I don't want to get too close. Shit. Let's uh, get this guy first. Dead. Gotcha. Oh, now we're on to something here. Now we're making it work. Yeah, and a loot bag. Oh, damn it. We were doing so good. Nice. Back up. Let's eat that food. Well, so much for that. Couldn't really get a good shot at him anyway. Hopefully the door doesn't wake them up. Okay. There's one. Two. Oh, damn it. Oh, 
Oh, got him right in the eye. The brown eye. She's dead, too. Man, I am just one sneaky son of a bitch. Tactical rifle schematic, and let's take this vitamin now. Keep us from getting infected. I'm surprised we haven't gotten infected already. All the hits we've taken. Now let's take two vitamins. Just to be safe. And two is better than one. That's always the case, right? I mean, think of anything in the world right now. Two is better, right? Of course it is. Let's get this trash out of the way. Let's close that door. Oh, shit. Why am I closing doors all the time? It's a stupid habit. I can't break it. Oh, well, he's the only one that woke up. We can still be sneak. Oh! The fucking zombies are sneakier than I am. Oh, shit. Here we go. Damn. Look at this mess. Oh, shit. I missed that one. Come on down here. There was another one out there. Right here. Nice. Let's go for number two. Bam. I know there's more up there. Oh, got a cop. See if we can take him out with one shot. Beautiful. Now for the face plant. Bloop. <laughs> there's one more. Oh, look at this. Oh, shit. There was even another one. Come on, lady. Oh. I was hitting this iron frame right there. Dead. Well, hey, four out of five ain't bad. Ooh, level six steel helmet. I don't think that's any better than the level six SWAT helmet we're currently wearing, but I'll check it out later. If not, we can certainly sell that thing and make a good amount of coin. There we go. Just take our time. I don't know if I can shoot through these bars or not. I guess not. Got him. Oh, damn it. Come here. Shit, I thought I'd be able to kill this one without waking up anyone else, but I guess that's not gonna happen. Everyone's awake now. Oh. Oh, let's just go. Oh, boy. Damn it. How about we just make this a speed run? Son of a bitch. <laughs> Let me in. Fucking birds. Oh, boy. This is the unstealthiest stealth run probably in history. I know there's another bird out here. Come on, you fuck. Let's finish it. Here we go. See ya. No. Fuck this shit. Let's go. Some bullshit. Look at this guy hanging out like a kind of disgusting ceiling fan. Um, this is the way we gotta go. See if we can get up in this window without waking up the zombies inside. There we go. Nice. One. Two. Is there more? Yep. Three. Oh, shit. Guess we're going outside again. Yay. More birds. Let's see if we can get the drop on them this time. Nope. Okay. Just as well. Oh, son of a bitch. Uh.
Yeah, fall off, you fuck. Oh, here we go. Dead. All right. Sneaky time. Oh. Okay, we didn't wake anyone up there. I gotta stop closing doors. Oh. What the hell woke that guy up? I don't know. Am I doing something wrong? Or am I just naturally a fucking loud, obnoxious piece of shit because I'm from New Jersey? I think that's the problem. This is ridiculous. Back behind this door. Jeez. Close the door. Close the door. <laughs> That's fun. So much more fun than being sneaky, right? Actually, no. That's not true. Being sneaky is fun. When you can pull it off. I just can't fucking pull it off. Look at that. First try again. Nice. Okay, getting some good loot. Let's get up here now. I could care less about that bathroom. Um, I think this is the way to go. Yep. Out this window right here. Damn near morning. Don't think we need the night vision on out here. Fucking sun's coming up. I don't remember if I mentioned this at the beginning of the episode. I meant to, but what I did was before um, we started, I backed out and I came back in and I turned the uh, day length to 120 minutes. This way, the night would be longer. You know, otherwise, it would have been morning... Like 30 minutes ago. This part is going to be interesting. Uh, there's a lot of zombies in this area on the rooftop. So, I'm, uh, as always, I'm going to try my best to take them all out. Being sneaky. Because I'm not going to give up on the sneak. I'll never give up. This whole fucking episode is like a metaphor for life, you know? No matter how many times you fail or screw up, just keep trying. Just keep doing it, you know? Don't ever quit. What's the point of quitting? As long as you're still breathing, it's not too late. It's not too late to get better, to improve, to change things. You gotta keep fighting. Look at this. It's fucking morning, and now I'm being sneaky. Out here in the daylight, I can be sneaky. But inside, when it's dark and I'm wearing night vision goggles... Oh! I spoke too soon. Yeah, how you like that? Man, the slamming the door in their face technique never gets old. It's funny and it's effective. Oh, I shouldn't have been running. I'm getting impatient here. And that's not good when you're trying to be stealthy. Where did you come from? Is there anything in here? No? What? What? Well, fuck those things. All right. Not going to close the door. Because that might wake some zombies up. And I know there are some zombies down here. What the fuck, man? <laughs> you know what? Fuck this shit. Might as well have some fun. This is going to hurt. That ah, was worth it. Let's just go down there. Oh, shit. I didn't know there were this many left. Nice. Now things are going to get a little crazy, though. We got this helipad rooftop, and that thing is going to be filled with zombies. Okay. Oh! 
Damn it. Let's get out of here. Maybe the rest won't wake up. Oh, shit. Yeah, you missed, bitch. Oh, have a nice trip. Motherfucker. Hey, big boy. Oh, damn. <laughs> that looked like it hurt. Great. More waking up. I mean, if they're going to come down here one at a time, that'll make things a little easier for me. Come on, fall off the edge. Damn it. I'm just getting aggravated. Oh, <laughs> what are you doing, big boy? What's up with these big boys thinking they're all nimble and shit? You're not a cat. Can't be jumping off the roof. Oh, damn. Still got quite a bit of zombies up here. Um, that guy's radiated, so let's start with this cop. Damn it. Didn't kill him. Oh, is he radiated too? It's hard to tell in this lighting. What was that? A blank? Looked like he was gonna puke. Oh! That time he did. Oh shit, he's gonna blow. Go for it. Nice. Oh, we better deal with this one now. See if we can get him to blow up too. Oh, oh there's another cop even. This is not good. Not good at all. We need some exploding darts. Lost a couple frames there. Back up! Oh, that was stupid. Alright, we gotta get behind this door. Take a breather for a second. Or not. Holy shit. Fuck you. Yeah, what? I'm too good at this shit. You can't catch me. Where's that other one? Oh. Listen, bird. Had enough of your shit. He's just up there, uh, waiting for me, I guess. Come here, man. There we go. Whoops. <laughs> Nothing like a good trip down the steps, huh? Oh, for fuck's sake. Will you just blow up already? Here we go. And that's all, folks. Gross. Well, that was uh, exciting, right? Wasn't even like the main area yet. Oh, this is the main area. What zombie just made that noise? Oh! Fuck off, bird. Oh, big mama. Up there. Let's take this bird out. Nice. Um, I want to get in here because there's some... There's some crates in there. Big Mama's stuck in there, so I'm not worried about her right now. See if we can take Big Boy out. That didn't work. You know what? Maybe we should kill Big Mama while she's stuck up there. Damn, that's six flaming arrows. Seven. Not a very good case for flaming arrows. Eight. To take out Big Mama. Uh, that just pissed them off. Come on, get up, big boy. What the fuck is he doing? Big boy. What? Uh, he's stuck. I'll help you. Okay. There's another one up here. Two more, I think. One more on this level, and then another one on the, uh, the roof. Sounds like there's a bird on the roof also. Some ammo. Oh, yeah. Come on, you piece of shit. Let's just get up there. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Choppity chop, bitch. All right, main stash, and we are out of here. Oh, where'd you come from, radiated big mama? Uh-oh. 
Damn it. She did. Um. All right. Let's just go for the loot. Then we got to get up there, right? So we can make the jump. Close that door out here. And then... I guess we can make that jump, right? Yep. Home free. We did it. We weren't as sneaky as I wanted to be, but... Whatever. It's a win in my book. All right, now for the hardened chest. I'm just going to go ahead and eat the jailbreaker candy. Even though we have three lockpicks, I could attempt to break into this thing without using the jailbreaker candy, but that's what I bought it for, so I don't care. Let's just get in here, get the loot, get the fuck out of here. I'm done messing around with this POI. It was pretty fun, though, right? Something different. You got to do something different every now and again. Nice, look at that. Got a good amount of good loot today. You know, not just... Uh, Random shit. Actually, actual good stuff. Our Jeep is down there. Let's make our jumps. I know that's a bit nerve-wracking, but with the oh shit candy, there's nothing to worry about. Here, let's do the ultimate Flintstone. Jump into the Jeep. Nice. All right. Fuck you, Kenny. Oh, that makes me feel better. All right, time to head home. That's going to be it for this episode. Now, once I get home, I'll drop this loot off. And then uh, when we come back in to record day 36, I will switch the um, the day hours back to 60 minute days. I set it to 120 just for this episode so we can do the night raid. And I hope you guys enjoyed that. We got to try some different shit every now and again, especially, you know, we're deep into this series. We're waiting for Alpha 20 to drop. Just wanted to do something different for you guys, and I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and all of the support. It really does mean a lot. You guys can follow me on Instagram or Twitter. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more Lockdown and more Farmer Glock, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.